This is the healthy mop kitchen. This is where I like to get creative. Today, I'm not cooking shit. Look at what I have. Almond milk. It has calcium, vitamin A, vitamin D, vitamin E. Cow milk doesn't have any of those vitamins. Coconut milk. Cocoa milk. It has calcium, vitamin A, vitamin B12, and a little bit of iron. Cow milk doesn't have any of that. This is my personal fucking favorite. Hemp milk. Hemp makes anything and everything. Almost like a human does, except we tell ourselves we can't. I can't do this. I can't do that. Hemp milk has vitamin A, calcium, vitamin D, theamine, or theamine, or theamine, fuck it. B12, magnesium. The only reason you're drinking cow milk is because either your parents, your family, your friends, they all, you know, they all got you accustomed to drinking it because you need milk. First of all, you only need milk when you're a baby growing up. It's part of the development. It's part of the growth of the body. Second of all, milk. The one that we drink is from a cow. To develop ourselves, we need human milk. You only need it for like, what, a few months? Maybe one year after you're born, and that's it. The thing about coconut milk, almond milk, all these other non-dairy milks, but it's water-based, so not only are you getting water, but you're supposed to be drinking water every day, more than once a day, more than five, more than eight glasses a day, eight cups a day, it's enriched with vitamins, and this shit tastes fucking good. And cow milk gives you a fucking uh, phlegm in your throat, it gives you prostate cancer, you're not a cow. You have no idea how fucking great this shit is. If you haven't tried it, try it. Just try it. It's three bucks, four bucks. Because I feel like this is the most important thing in our time, in our day of age. The feds want you to drink cow milk. The feds want you to be sick. Obi wants you to be healthy, okay? You're being attacked. I'm being attacked. The difference between me and people who aren't smoking weed, they're not being protected. We're being attacked by our taste buds. If you haven't figured it out by now, you eat three times a day, you eat more than three times a day. All of those meals are full of shit that is making you sick. What do we do about it? We stop investing into the meat and to the dairy. And we start investing into the veggies, the grains, the nuts. No more cow milk, okay? Are you a cow? Even if you want to be a cow, you have to understand that this shit is not for your body. Whatever you're looking for, just think about it for a second. Close your eyes. What's that thing that you've always been thinking about that you just can't stop thinking about? Now visualize it. Put yourself in that visualization. So it's you and that thing that you love. Once you see it, it's yours and that's it. No one can touch it. If you have a dream, go for it. What are you waiting for? I'm here. Shit, I could be playing PS4. I got the new Call of Duty, World War II. You already know World War III is coming. Oh shit, no, World War III is happening, okay? And you know where it's on? It's in your mouth, it's your taste buds. They're fucking you in the mouth and you're not doing anything about it. Come on, that's what we're here for. That's what Healthy Mouth was made for. We're here to help you become that warrior you were always meant to be. These are Tostitos, but yo, there's no animals in it. Why should you follow a plant-based lifestyle? You'll be a little closer to finding that inner peace in yourself once you make that transition to a vegan lifestyle. The plant-based lifestyle elevates your perspective to like new levels that you've never even thought existed. Even when you're eating junk food, like your stomach doesn't feel bad. You don't feel like you're like, oh my God, I'm so bloated. Uh. Oh, by the way, I'm sober. All right, and I'm not condoning to stay sober. All right, be right back. This is the answer. I gotta take a few hits right now so I can be in accordance to the healthy mob regulations. The only regulations I follow, by the way. Bad news, the pen is out of battery. Fuck. You 
you know what? Don't let anything that's not life threatening affect you. You feel me? The pen is out of battery. We're gonna go recharge the pen. Oh.